hi repeated multiplication let us do the fourth worksheet the first activity is compute the powers given below an example is given 3 by 5 whole cube is equal to 3 by 5 into 3 by 5 into 3 by 5 that is product of the numerators divided by product of the denominators 3 into 3 into 3 by 5 into 5 into 5 is equal to 3 cube by 5 cube which is equal to 3 into 3 9 9 threes are 27 5 into 5 25 25 into 5 is 125 to compute the powers we need only these three steps one and this one and this one okay, okay. then first one is 2 by 3 whole raised to 5 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 and 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 2 into 2 is 4 4 into 4 is 16 16 into 2 is 32 by 3 into 3 is 9 9 into 9 81 81 into 3 243 we can write then 3 by 5 whole raised to 4 again we can write 3 multiplied by 3 four times divided by 5 multiplied by 5 four times repeatedly which is equal to 81 by 625 and 1 by 2 power 10 1 power any number is 1 divided by 2 into 10 times 2 so 2 into 2 4 16 16 into 16 256 into 4 1024 and 2 1 by 2 whole cube how will you make this mixed fraction into improper fraction 2 into 2 4 4 plus 1 is 5 5 by 2 2 1 by 2 is same as 5 by 2 so 5 by 2 whole cube is equal to 5 into 5 into 5 divided by 2 into 2 into 2 which is equal to 125 divided by 8 how will you make this 125 by 8 into mixed fraction divide 125 divided by 8 is equal to 15 whole number part is 15 so 15 here then 5 by 8 this remainder is 5 5 by 8 15 5 by 8 okay that you have learned last year and fifth standard also 2 by 7 whole cube is equal to same way how to do and get the answer as 8 by 343 from this table you have to learn a thing what is it 0.3 whole cube is equal to 0.3 into 0.3 into 0.3 0.3 means 3 by 10 here multiplying 3 into 3 into 3 is 27 and how many decimal places are there 1 2 3 or 1 2 3 from here also you will get that is three decimal places from here also you will get in the answer there will be three decimal places one decimal place into 3 1 into 3 3 and 0.15 whole square multiply four decimal places will be there and how will you get from here Two decimal place into two, that is four decimal places. Two point seven whole cube. Multiply like this and get this answer. How many decimal places? Three decimal places here. One decimal place here. Into three, so three decimal places. One point two power four whole power four. how many places how many decimal places four decimal places that is 1 into 4 four decimal places and here how many decimal places 
3 into 2. 6 decimal places. See, 3 plus 3, 6 decimal places are there in the answer. Okay, that you have to bear in mind. Compute the powers given below. 1.1 1 .1 whole cube. Multiply 1.1 by 1.13 times. And uh, the product is multiply 11 square is 121. 121 into 11 is equal to 1331. And how many decimal places? Here 1 decimal place into 3. 3 decimal places. 1.331. Here 2 decimal places. So in the answer 2 into 5. 10 decimal places will be there. And what is 2 raised to 5? It is 32. And 32 and how many zeros you will have to put after the decimal point? 8 zeros you will have to put. And 1 power any number is 1. But it is here 0 0.1 power 6. So how many decimal places? 1 into 6, 6 decimal places. So 0 0.1. 5 zeros and a 1. And 0 0.07 square. 7 square is 49. And how many decimal places? 2 into 2, 4. So 0 0.0049. 1.5 whole square, 2.25. 2 decimal places are there in the answer. Here it is 16 cubed is equal to 4096. 36 square is equal to 1096. Compute the powers given below. 1.6 whole cube is equal to. How many decimal places will be there? 1 into 3. 3 decimal places. We know 16 cube is 4096. 3 decimal places means from here you have to count. 1, 2, 3. And after 4 you have to put a point. So, it is 4.096 and 0 0.16 whole cube. How many, how many decimal places? 2 into 3, 6 decimal places. From here it is 4 numbers, or 4 digits are here and we want 6 decimal places. So, 1, 2, 3, 4 and we have to put 2 more zeros here. Okay, so the answer is 0 0.004096 and here 3 into 3, 9 decimal places. So, how many zeros? 4 plus 5, 5 zeros, 4 digits are here. So, 5 more zeros we have to put. 3.6 square is 12.96. 2 decimal places and here 4 decimal places 2 into 2 4 and here 3 into 2 6 decimal places so 2 zeros we had to put and here 4 into 2 8 decimal places so 4 zeros you had to put and here 5 into 2 10 decimal places so 6 zeros we have to put in the activity 3, 1 by 2, 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4, plus 1 by 8 here. 2, 2 are 4, 4, 2 are 8. So, the next one is 8 into 2, 16. And here it is 1 minus 1 by 2. Here, 1 minus 1 by 4. Here it is 1 minus 1 by 8. Here it is 1 minus 1 by 16. You can do this Practice it using color paper. Okay. And if you want you can draw the picture also. Figure also. And here it is just written in the exponential form. 2 square is 4. 8 is 2 cube. And uh, 16 is 2 raised to 4. Written in the exponential form. And here 16 into 2. 32. So the last term is 1 by 32. And here it is 1 minus 1 by 32. And this is the exponential form. One side of a square is 12 centimeter. What is its area? 
If a side is 4.5 cm, what is the area of that square? Area of square is equal to side into side, 12 cm into 12 cm, 144 cm square is equal to area of this square is equal to 4.5 into 4.5 that is how many decimal places 1 2 20.25 cm square okay then uh, here in this multiplication there is a trick in doing the multiplication involving squares of numbers ending in 5 what is that? Do you want to know that? See. 15 square is equal to. Here 1. First you have to write this 25. Okay. Then 1 and the next number is 2. 1 into 2. 2. 225. And 25 square is equal to. First write 25. Then 2 and uh, the next number is 3. 2 into 3, 6. 625. Only for the numbers ending in 5. And the square of these numbers. Okay. Then 35 square is equal to the first right 25. Then 3 into 4, 12. Then 45 square is 20, 25. 4 into 5 is 20, 2025. 55 square is 5 into 6, 30. 33,025. Okay. And so on. Just multiply and get the same answer. Will you get the same answer? Try it yourself. Okay. Thank you. Bye.